Right, hello people. Uh, you've read the title of this video. Um, it's all coming up later on in this video. We're going to start by showing you what we got up to yesterday and then I've got a serious thing I need to get off my chest. So please stick with us right till the end. Enjoy. Right, hello people. Good day to one and all. From? Penisa Penisa Peniscola. Peniscola, that's the one, yeah. <laughs> so we've just been, we've just finished our tour of the castle. If you missed that, go back to yesterday's video. Yes, please do. It was a good day. It was a good, uh, really good. good time up there. Yeah. yeah. And now we're just heading into town, see if anything is open today yeah. because it is coming up to 10 o'clock. Everything has been shut all yesterday. Yeah. It's looking a bit shut so far. And it's Monday, so we're fingers crossed it's just something to look at today. Something must be open. Do you want to go up this way? I think, you know, I think we should go that way. This way, yeah. Um, if nothing's going to be open today, then I think... It's shut for Christmas, I think so everything's. Say. I think we're going to really struggle for anywhere being open any time yeah. for the rest of this trip. Yeah. So, fingers crossed. If uh, Benidorm's closed for the winter, yeah. then the rest of it's going to be, yeah. really, isn't it? Let's think. So, it's just turned 10. I think some things are going to be open because we've just found a market. So. Yeah, a little, just a little local market. Um, and if there's a market on, I'm guessing some shops are going to be open as well. It's going to bring people into the town, the market, isn't it? It's brought us in. Look at all these old buildings, look. I wonder if there used to be hotels and stuff. Quite possibly. Yeah, it's only a very tiny market, but hey, we're happy for anything at the moment, yeah. aren't we? Right, I think we've got here a bit early. I think some of them are still setting up. Still setting up, yeah. I'm guessing it's one of these places which is like uh, 10 till 2, 10 till 1. Probably, yeah, they close early, don't they? Yeah, but there's a place just behind us here. Everything is selling is 1 euro. You can get a coat, a pair of jeans. You get jackets. Underwear, ev everything. You can get a jacket for a euro. He did, that was that was it, he, 1 euro still, wasn't it? Mm. I'm not being funny, you can't snub that, can you? No. That's really good. That is fantastic. Yeah. And actually, there's a lot of clothes stores here, isn't there? Yeah. <laughs> clothes, 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 clothes. Market done. That was really good. Cheap. All women, though. There's only one stall with anything to do with men on it. No, there was not. There was not. Right, I don't really know where we're going to be. Well, I'm I'm optimistic. It does look like is more you, shops are going to be open today. Should we go down this way then? Or? I don't so know. Where's home now? Is it this way or that way? I don't know. I need to get my map out, Mazzy. Mazzy wanted me to show you all this. A little parky area, a little stream running through the town, a little lake thing up there. It's nice. We didn't see this yesterday. And out to sea. Yeah, it might look okay, yeah. but it stinks. Yeah, it do smell a little. <laughs> it absolutely stinks. But we've got the funkiest motorhome to show you ever. Let's go over the road, yeah. So here it is. I don't want to show too much detail because we've... No, don't be showing number plates, but the artwork is amazing. Just check out the artwork on it. Oh, a lady's helping you, wants help. Wait, oh, no, English. gracias. No. <laughs> Gracias, I thought she wanted help, she was selling I think she, No, I think she was trying to give us some, to be honest. No, she was selling it. <laughs> um, yeah, very nice, very nice. Unique, where's it from? France. France, yeah. That's what I want to do with ours, just paint it however we want it to look. <laughs> One day when it's 50 years old. <laughs> Next year then. <laughs> It's not that old. How old is our van? It's having on a bit now though. 15, isn't it? 16 years. So mm. Penny School, it does keep going on and on. But I think it's mainly just like apartments where people live, all the other bit. I don't think it's a shoppy bit. Um, there isn't that many shops here. We haven't walked into it yet. Well, we have sort of yesterday. Well, we did, yeah. So what are you saying? What I'm saying is, I thought there were more to it than there actually is. No. When like, we got home yesterday, you kept saying, oh, we didn't do the town, but we had. Yeah. Like all down there, that's just apartments. So, yeah, we need yeah, to go back, go back, don't we? Yeah, let's go back this way, yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know if you can see on the side of the van there, it's got like a, a face, like a joker face. It's beautiful. Oh yeah, you need a good eye to see that. I've got a good eye and a bad eye. The fattest pigeons in the whole of Spain. They get well fed, Jesus. Look at the size of you. Right, we have got a little statue thing here. Come on, fatty. What's this? Not sure what I'm looking at. I've said it before though, such random things all around Spain when it comes to artwork. This is such a lovely park area full of birds. Check those big massive black ones out down there. Oh, Cardarons. <laughs> They're gonna move, aren't they, as soon as we get close? I don't know. Cardarons, there's quite a lot of them, but GoPro's so not gonna pick it up brilliantly. Mm. Look at them all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Never seen so many all together. And they're not even moving, honey, are they? What is that big thing, by the way? What big thing? Oh, what they're on. Is it like a sink a plug hole? No, oh, it's your <laughs> duck and bird toilet. So that they don't, don't fall in. who on anybody. I'm hoping they're all gonna stay there. And I can just get a bit of a closer view. No, one's off. Don't all go, don't all go. I'll leave them to it, but how beautiful is that? I've never seen so many together. I just wish they'd all have the wings open. Right, so we've been around the town. It's been a long day, hasn't it? Mm. <laughs> been really, really good though. Follow well, enjoyed it. I'm just regretting booking four mm. days though now, because we've done it. I feel like we've done, we totally did everything today, including mm. sort of yesterday as well. Who knows, more shops might be open yeah. tomorrow. Maybe if we go later in the day tomorrow, more shops might be open. Yeah. To be honest, the shops didn't isn't what I was looking for today. Going up to that castle today, it, which was on yesterday's video, and never seen it go to yesterday's video. It was so good, mm. wasn't it? There I'll was so what, much up there. We might go back there in an afternoon. Tomorrow. What day after, maybe. Might get tired of doing it two days on trot. You know, shops might be open up Did there. Did we only and... arrive yesterday? Yeah. Oh, we've got two more days. Two more full days. Oh, I see. So, yeah, I think we might go yeah. back and later in the day. Yeah. See if it takes off a bit. And hit out for like, some lunch again or something, couldn't we? Yeah. That'd be nice. So we've done just over four miles, 4.2 yeah. miles. Um, Knackered now, I'm feeling it now. <laughs> we've got back, all along the seafront is, is closed. Every bar, every restaurant. It's just, just all shut. Season, though. Yeah. Um, we've come into this is our bar on yeah. our campsite. It's really pretty. With the only ones out here, it's just all shut down. <laughs> Everything's we, shut we down. We don't want to sit on them posh dressed up tables. Yeah. They've got the wine glasses proper, and proper ones. <laughs> yeah. And there, there is some inside, but we wanted to sit outside. Yeah, get a bit of air. Yeah. So there's literally only one. Um, one drink on tap. No, I mean one. Oh, one table outside. Yeah. One table suitable for <laughs> commoners like which us. We think might actually be the workers, the staff. Yeah. <laughs> which we. I might even move it up in sun, Mazza. I'd rather be in the sun. We did get off the tapas again just now, didn't we? Olives again. Well, I always feel so bad, like we're coming across rude, sort of saying, no, it's, no, no, gracias, gracias, we're fine, we're fine. <laughs> it's the way they react, it's yeah, like, they're shocked. no, no, yeah. but you don't want them. Yeah. And then, but that's the first time for us, uh, we said no, because we don't like olives. And then he offered us and then he, beans, almonds. Yeah, he, he didn't speak English, no, it was all in Spanish, no, but he yeah. offered almonds and nuts and crisps, I think. Yeah. Um, but we said no. Yeah. So, we still haven't shown you, but we will. Maybe well, this today is or tomorrow. We've been in here, isn't it? We're not, we've not been in here yet. No. But we're definitely going to show you the uh, pool at some point. I'm sure we can get into this side. Because this is on this side of the campsite, we're on the other side. I'm sure we can get in there for a look around. I do like these lights that are going up through the palm trees. You can imagine when they're lit up, they're spread out like at night. I reckon that'd be quite nice. Wouldn't it? I'd prefer lights here upward lights yeah. although saying that 
them lights might put nice little shadows down here. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. I can imagine in the height of summer, when you've got like your bouncy castle up and entertainment on and all this is full of chairs, I can imagine it's a really good Again, place. So it is lovely, it is really nice. Yeah. And you did figure out where to empty the toilet, although you haven't done it yet. Yeah, it's <laughs> quite it's quite away from where we parked. Yeah, so we'll probably Not just a problem. do that another uh, day. Showers are very nice, I went in there this morning. Yeah. It's not a push button one, it's a proper shower and it's like a proper cubicle nice and clean and you've got a it's like the shower and then you walk around the corner into your own little cubicle a bit so it's not yeah. like one you know what I mean? Yeah. so your clothes don't get wet basically yeah. <laughs> oh. what we done? yeah she's, she's telling us not to film again or something yeah probably turn that off <laughs> so we did just notice this bit which looks beautiful gonna have to climb up here because you might be able to see over into the swimming pool and it's not only you who hasn't seen it yet neither have we no nope, still can't see maybe if I just go like that now you can see and I can't that ain't fair is it you get to see our swimming pool before we do oh, look at lonely Mazzy all the way over there on her own She's saying there's probably ladies over there in bikinis. I hope there is. I'll edit this one, love. <laughs> right. That is the end of this video. We had really big plans today. We were going to get the scooters out. We were going to go four miles to another little town further up and have a really nice day. I was ready. All ready. And then I had a very, very, very upset girlfriend. Okay really don't like doing this hate giving i just hate feeding the trolls um but i'm going to do this once once only and then they are never ever going to be mentioned by us again um and we'll leave it at that so haters trolls nasty scum um i've dealt with them in the past I've had channels taken down in the past. I've had websites taken down in the past. People just spreading lies um, and being very, very, very insulting. And we're not taking it anymore. This It's completely ruining it for, for Mazzy. Um, and I'm not, I'm not putting up with it. So, let me just tell you, there is a website now it's known it's there just to attack influencers um youtubers that's all it does there's people who have committed suicide from reading the nasty comments on there you get in touch with the website themselves that they, they just completely ignore anything you send them they've been in the news um people are taking them to court i'm hoping one day they're gonna it's gonna be shut down is that website it is just it's it's just a breeding ground for the scum of the earth. I'm not even going to mention the website name. Um, but if you hate a YouTuber, people tend to go onto this website, create a, a topic. It's like a forum. Create a topic about a certain influencer and then invite people to come and read what they're saying. Say a load of lies, be really insulting, um, make little videos, spread them on that website, spread them on Facebook, let everyone know, and, and breed. The bre This scum just breeds like mould. Um, and you want to, we read it, and we want to stick up for ourselves. But I keep saying to Mazzy, we've just got to stop reading it. You can't stop these scum. Um... I just want to run through a few of the things they've been saying. The one I I haven't been on that for a month, but what I read at the time, uh, Mazzy is just living off benefits. Mazzy claims nothing for her ill health. All the money Mazzy earns is through YouTube. That is it. Dan is getting paid to be her carer. Uh, I don't get paid nothing. All the money I earn is through YouTube. 
Um, and and it and they started getting really really personal. Mazzy's pregnant because she's put a bit of weight on. Mazzy's got a big nose. How I wanted to swear then. How how low and scummy and pathetic can an adult be to go onto a website and tell everyone, look at her, she's got a big nose. How pathetic. And you know what? Some of our viewers see this, they see it spread on Facebook and they'll go over and they'll read it, but they won't do anything about it. And it's time for you guys to start sticking up for the travel trolls. Not just the travel trolls. Any anyone on YouTube, any influencer, if you see someone spreading hate about someone you like to watch, please start sticking up for us all. Because enough is enough. Um, you're going to have to start defending us or lose us, because we will just stop making videos. We're not here to be... to have scum breeding like that. We're just not here to put up with that, and we're not going to do. So, what am I asking for, really? If you see any nasty video about us or anybody else, anybody, report it. Okay, there is a report on every video on YouTube. You can click on the settings and report. Report it as harassment, hate, bullying, whatever you want to call it. There's a big list of options. Report it. If 50 people report it, the video will be taken down. If a thousand people report the channel, the channel will be taken down. And you guys really have to start sticking up for everyone who does this. Otherwise, you're going to start losing people. I've heard, I know of people who have committed suicide because of this. Um, so today for us is ruined. We're not going out. Because they've won today. They've won today, but they're not going to win the battle. Um, let me just take a minute, yeah? Now, I know by making this video, it's probably the worst thing we could have done. Or I could have done. Uh, I'm just feeding the haters, I'm feeding the trolls, and they will be making more videos. Spread. They're going to love this, they're going to be spreading more, because that's how it works. Um, but I don't care, I'm getting it off my chest, once and for all, I've had enough of them. The funny thing is, I've done this over two channels, between the two channels, what, uh, 300,000 subscribers, 12 years and met thousands and thousands of viewers you know how many haters have actually come up to my face and said you know what i can't stand you, you know how many i can count them on one hand in fact i can't even do that zero not a single person has had the balls to come up to my face and be nasty to my face the hide behind the computers um, these people on these videos and these forums and these uh, social media groups, how many of them actually use their real name? Zero. Nobody knows who they are because they haven't got the balls to even say, this is me and I don't like the travel trolls. Who are you? Who are you? We don't know because you haven't got the balls. You're just little cowards hiding behind your little keyboard. So, until the... I remember one time, right? I remember reading one of these scummy groups about eight years ago. They were all saying, Oh, Dan's here. Um, let's all meet up and go beat him up. I've read it a couple of months ago. I'd love to knock him out. I'm going to knock him out one day. No one's ever done it. You're never going to do it. You haven't got the balls. So I know that the haters are going to love this video. This will be on that website, they'll be making videos about it, spreading it all, saying, Oh, I've really hit a nerve there, I've really got to Dan, yeah. Um, you've made me angry, you certainly ain't upset me, I'm hard as nails up here, you can't hurt me. Um, I've been through all this for 12 years, I'm used to it. But you are hurting Mazzy, well done, congratulations. Um, she won't be on video today. So... So what am I saying, really? Um, yeah, to all our viewers, 
please, if if you see any of these scummy comments, these lies, and they are lies, I can assure you. We video us 24-7. You, you know us as well as, as family know us. We don't hide anything from you. Um, so there is no hidden agenda. There is no... You know, there's no lies. What you see is what you get. So if you see comments on your Facebook groups, we're not even on Facebook anymore for for these kind of reasons. If you see these nasty comments on your Facebook groups and, and links to watch these videos and stuff like that, stick up for us and other influence. I'm not just, I, I know I'm saying us because this is about us, but it's happening to everybody. You need to stick up for us. Leave them comments saying, shut your mouth, you just pathetic, grow up, go away, get back under your rock. Report them all. Report the comments on Facebook. Report the videos. Let's get them taken down. Um, I just haven't got time. I could seriously attack these guys back and get all them channels and uh, things taken down. I just haven't got time. I'm too busy trying to make videos uh, for you guys. So, yeah. That is the end of this video. We'll be back tomorrow. I'm sorry if it... I know, I'm, I'm, I'm addressing this to you in an angry way, and I shouldn't be, because 99.9% .9 of you are lovely, and that's why we do it. Um, but this 0.01% of scum, we need to take them down. So if from now on, if you see that, don't tell us, don't email us. I know people have in the past to warn us, oh, there's a nasty video about you. Thank you for doing that, but we don't want to know. We don't want to see the videos. We don't want to read the comments. We just don't want to know what these scum are saying about us because it hurts. Um, just get them reported. Let's uh, stop all this hate. Um, so we're taking the rest of the day off. Very, very sorry. Uh, sorry I'm angry, but I am. And we will be back tomorrow, hopefully bright and bubbly, and have put this behind us. You all have a good evening. And don't worry, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. Um, but just attacking us for our appearance, for the way we act, because we smoke, because we like a drink, just the tiniest most pathetic reasons for attacking people it's just bullying it is cyber bullying you know it's ironic really we're called travel trolls but it is the trolls who are really getting to us at the moment so yeah start sticking up for us stick by us and let's uh, let's rebuild this channel and make it positive again starting tomorrow you all take care have a wonderful evening love you lots goodbye